watching! Oh, hi, I'm back. Well, I, for one, like Roman numerals. Oh, we're off to a good start. Wax museum, but one of the dudes is real and they don't tell you who. You're not the girl boss of me. I want a divorce. You're a terrible male wife. Fine. I'm keeping the gate, though. Wait, what gate? Architects think they're so creative. Have you ever tried thinking outside the box? No, like literally. Your building is just like any other in a square foundation, and next to that is another square of the building. New York is just a bunch of squares with streets in between. Hey, hey, hey. You can't call us out like that because it's the truth. Do you ever stop to realize that the average person doesn't know what a ship is or what cannon means? We probably all just sound like pirates. And odds, I'm begging you not to invent Muppet racism, please! Please! Me and the boys up at 3 a.m. inventing Muppet racism. Didn't technically Avenue Q kind of dabble into that? Someone in my younger sibling's class said they were yandere for them, and my sibling responded, first of all, cringe, second of all, red flag, and no phrase has entered my daily lexicon so fast! Bigfoot, but fully shaved. Mr. Clean. Posts like these are why I have anxiety! If you've heard of writer's block, get ready for reader's block. You want to read, you have time, you know what to read, or how have a pile of books ready to be read, you cannot sit still and focus enough to do so, and you can't even open the book. Thanks, I hate it. I wonder if my ancestors are smiling upon me sometimes. You, making a little thing with clay. The ghost of Atralopithecus. Yes, 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 yes! Wait, gays can read? Guys, what does that say? I don't know. One of my favorite character archetypes is small, cute character that is horrifyingly powerful in their canon. I mean, look at this. These children have fought literal gods and won. Well, one is a being made of two different gods and also living primordial ooze, able to kill the biggest god in the setting. One with a soul that is equivalent to every single monster soul combined with the power of mental time travel through sheer force of will and one that is apparently born of dark matter, able to disintegrate anything and integrate anything into himself. And they're all non-binary. Conclusion! Non-binary people are strong enough to kill God. Love it. Howdy. May I offer you a cup of warm boy? Yes, you can. Thank you. My friend asked me why I keep a shotgun in the kitchen. I told him it was for Decepticons. He laughed, I laughed, the toaster laughed. I shot the toaster. Good times, good times, man. If I were a witch, I'd simply turn people into things for fun. I'd be a total bitch, a fucking asshole. So no change then. Damn straight. The fact that 2021 begun with a sea shanty renaissance and three months later ships are back on the 1700 trade routes is actually... <laughs> Extremely funny. <laughs> Fuck, why did I ever think about this? Fuck Spotify sometimes. Where's the love for the YouTube music? I get fucking all the vaporwave people I live. Not even on Spotify. Fucking use YouTube music. Do it. Do it right now. What are you doing? Dude, how do some of you all function under stress? I'm sitting here eating cold Pop-Tarts while playing the Wii theme on a kazoo because I have a ton of things to do soon and I'm stressed, but not stressed enough to do anything about it. My mind is really going like, yo, you have 17 things to do within the week and I'm just like, DON'T WANT ME AT THE FUCKING TELLER!